This is the 24 volt page of the electrical diagram. We've got 120 volts coming into a transformer becoming 24 volts AC. A 121A that goes through a fuse and comes out at 121B. Goes into the unit shutdown switch located on the outside of the control panel and comes out at 121C. The 121 wire number indicates what line number it starts on. That 121C comes down and goes through a controller and becomes 128A. That 128A references the line number 128 where that wire started. Comes down and comes into a relay. This relay is FR1A. If you look right above the relay, it tells you FR1A stands for Fan Relay 1A. Look to the right side of the relay. It has a reference of 131. That's line number 131. Go to 131 and then come over and you'll find a contact for that relay FR1A. The number in parentheses after FR1A, 128, indicates where the coil is for that set of contacts. So if I go back over to the line numbers and up to 128, I'll slide over and I can find the coil for that set of contacts. For any switches that are adjustable, we have the settings on the diagram. This is LTC1. See off at 45 and on at 35. So no matter the current setting, you can always get back to the factory setting by locating the factory set point on the wiring diagram. Remember, factory settings can be found on the wiring diagrams laminated to the control panel door.